We as a team have been over the years developing uh, varieties to handle certain stresses, to handle certain malnutrition issues. So in the course of our work, we particularly developed beans that are rich in iron and zinc that would tackle the issue of malnutrition, especially micronutrient nutrition. And fortunately, some of the lines or some of the varieties that we developed are also um, drought tolerant in that they can withstand some of the, um, the droughts that are happening in Kalamoja and they are mature. They grow within a space of about 60 days. Eok Maret names our beans. This name, Eok Maret, is the name adopted by the people here. They said when you start that campaign, because our team engaged them to develop a plan for this campaign, you are launching the beginning, but the campaign is going to run for two years, and by the end of two years, here is what we hope to achieve. We hope to reduce the malnutrition from the current 41% to 30% in two years. Easy IRB beans. In fact, they taste very nice for children. They like it, and when they eat, at least they begin gaining weight. I must thank NARO, the NARO scientists, and the NARO management for and then the government partners together with us, the Minister of Karamoja Affairs, for initiating this, because we've opened war on fighting food insecurity, hunger, and also malnutrition. So the, we have launched several varieties, but the most prominent ones are beans. Now beans are going to be distributed to communities. Communities by there have already been trained on how to plant beans. So we already have farmer groups, and now the challenge has been lack of the seed material. And uh, we might require like almost 15 million US dollars, and it's going to be mobilized from development partners and also from my ministry. For us, we've already given some seed money of 300 million to the Nabuini Center, Naro and Karamoja, to begin multiplying these seeds, maize, and all the rest.